Stephen, thanks for joining us on Seagulls TV ahead of tomorrow's Round 8 clash with Sandringham at Burbank Oval. A uh, great weekend for the club last week with both senior and development sides getting the job done. Yeah, no, it was a great weekend for the boys. Um, obviously, it was a bit of a strange game uh, in the senior game with uh, only you know, seven goals kicked three quarter time and then I think we had 16 goals kicked overall in the last quarter. So, yeah, it was a bit of an odd day. And, uh, the weather was you know, perfect for footy uh, last weekend and hopefully it's much the same uh, tomorrow down at the Oval. And after a win like that last week, uh, it's great to be boosted by the inclusion of Lee Masters back into the lineup tomorrow. Yeah, so Lee, he received a bit of a slight concussion there against um, the WA uh, state team two weeks ago, so it was just precautionary in terms of giving him a rest last week and uh, obviously, as you say, he comes in just to further bolster the forward line um, for tomorrow's must-win game against Sandringham. And Nick Ebinger comes in for his third game as 23rd man. Great for him to get another uh, bit of experience at senior level. Yeah, Nick, uh, he's had a, a great pre-season. He obviously got rewarded there with uh, the first two rounds, playing as the 23rd, and uh, he's been in you know, reasonable form you know, in the development league team. So uh, he comes back in this week to, uh, again, provide us with a bit of flexibility around the forward line. He can also play back. And our opponent, Sandringham, sit in eighth place. Uh, they've picked a very strong side for tomorrow's game. You'd expect it to be a pretty high quality contest at the Bank Oval. Yeah, we went through their list last night. They got 18 to 19 you know, AFL listed players. So, you know, similar to Geelong, it's going to be a really tough game for our boys. And, you know, we make sure we you know, play four quarters and put forward a consistent effort and uh, have a solid win, uh, if possible, uh, tomorrow. Over. And our development boys also have a big battle on their hands. Uh, Sandringham's development side is sitting second on the table. Uh, we've also got four current TAC Cup players running out with us. What can you tell us about those guys? Yeah, as you say, Sandringham been a reasonable nick uh, at the start of the, start of the season. So uh, they've had the last two weeks off. So they'll be really fresh to um, hit us up and you know, give us a good hit out. And uh, as you say, we've got four boys coming through from the TAC uh, tomorrow. So, uh, Judah Dundon and Brock McGregor have come through from the Western Jets, and they'll actually play with us permanently for the rest of the season, um, just you know, through the system uh, AFL Victoria working on uh, for the rest of the year. And uh, Reese Piper and Tom Murphy come through from the Dandong Stingrays, and we're, they're a couple of boys we've been looking at uh, since last year. So, good opportunity for them. They've got the weekend off through the buy round at TAC level. So, I'll have a look and see how they go and um, as I said, unfortunate for the boys that miss out. Um, you know, it's not much we can do you know, from our end, but you know, again, it's a chance for us to have a look at these kids and um, you know, progress through uh, for the rest of the year. Now, tomorrow's game marks our third straight at home. Uh, no doubt the boys will be keen to continue the momentum in front of what's been a pretty healthy crowd at home this season. Yeah, no, we've been lucky. You know, we've had some really good weather. Uh, down at Burbank this week, this year so far, and um, yeah, the crowd's been really strong, which we appreciate the supporters coming out and uh, supporting the boys. And uh, as I say, if we can put another four quarter effort in at both grades, uh, hopefully we can go two or two, two from two again uh, tomorrow at, at down the ground. No worries, Steve. Thanks very much for joining us, and all the best for both games tomorrow. No worries. Thanks, Stu.